In this video, we're going to expand double brackets. So here's the first pair of brackets. We've got x plus 2, x plus 3. How we're going to do that is by drawing out a grid. Here's my grid. And at the top, I'm going to put the x and the plus 2 from the first bracket. And along the side, I'm going to put x and the plus 3. Now, in this grid, I'm going to multiply terms together. So in this first one here, I'm going to do x times x. So that gives me x squared. The next one I'm going to do 2 times x, i.e. the column times the row. So that 2 times x is 2x. This one here I'm going to do x times 3. So that, uh, x times 3, so it's going to be 3x. And in the last one I'm going to do 2 times 3. And that is 6. Now taking the four terms that I've just made, i.e. You know, these two and these two, I'm going to write them in a line. So we've got x squared plus 2x plus 3x plus 6. And now I just look to simplify, so I'm just going to add those two like terms together. So I get x squared plus 5x plus 6. That's my answer. OK, let's try it for these two examples here. So draw my grid out. x and minus 8 from the first bracket. x and plus 1 for the second bracket. OK, so... We're going to have x times x is x squared in here. x times negative 8 goes in here, negative 8x. x times positive 1, which is just x. And then negative 8 times 1, which is negative 8. Write those red terms out as a line. And then combine the two middle terms. Negative 8x plus x is negative 7x. So my answer is x squared minus 7x minus 8. Last one here, let's get the grid out again. So this bracket's going to go here, 3x and 1. And this bracket's going to go along the side, 2x minus 4. I'm going to multiply them. So we're going to get 3x times 2x is 6x squared. 2x times 1 is 2x. 3x times negative 4 is negative 12x. And negative 4 times 1 is negative 4. So I'm going to get 6x squared plus 2x minus 12x minus 4. Combine the two middle terms and we get 6x squared minus 10x minus 4.